Much, much worse than just an ugly win. Fuck toxic positivity. Yeah, I agree with you, bro. And see, this is the thing. I mean, I haven't been on social media. I haven't been on social media um, since the full-time whistle blew. And I haven't been on any Facebook pages or nothing. But I guarantee you, either today, this evening, tomorrow morning, you're going to have all of these Jovetic GIF images or graphics or all that kind of stuff. And they might say, they might have a post about Stepinski. And people were saying that he was not a good striker. Now he's one of us. We need to support him. We need... No, 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 no. Shut up. Shut up. Just fed up with it, man. It's, it's just all fake as well. This is the thing. Like, there's there's no sincerity behind a lot of these posts. It's for clout. Just think it for clout. Or oh, I'm going to pop a post about this player, then I'm going to see how many likes I can get, and then people put those little fucking heart emojis and saying, yes, yes, you're a true fan. You love your support. You love your team. You, you're a true supporter. Fuck off. I'm bothered with this toxic positivity. I can't stand it. Can't. It makes me sick. Hello, boys. I was one of Dambraska's most loyal supporters and believers up to today. The wind doesn't cut it for me. He should go and take with him Kuzo for sure. Well, bro, listen. I ain't going to say too much because you saying these things here doesn't get me into trouble. But if I say things, then certain people are going to get all rattled. Yeah. The way I see it is that things ain't good enough, man. They're not good enough. But the fact is, we won two games on, in a row. So you can't say, unfortunately, we can't say anything. Yes, we can say the performances weren't great. They weren't. They were dog shit. But we won. So doesn't matter, does it? And the fact is, where are we in the table? Third? How many points behind Aris? One point behind them? Okay, they've got Isle tomorrow and they'll probably smash them. But if they don't, then what? You know, we, we play Buffer away. And, and somehow, if we get a result, we cut it down to six points. And then all of a sudden, the toxic positivity is going to come out. Yes, we're going to win the league now. We're going to win the league. We've got a chance of winning the league. We ain't got a chance. We ain't got a chance. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Because even though them lot lost today, they're going to win next week, aren't they? And Ali are probably going to win more games. And they're going to make some really, really good signings in January. I know this. What are we going to do? We're gonna do. We're gonna not gonna sign a holding midfielder. No, no, no. We're gonna sign a centre forward that can actually score goals. That doesn't need fifteen chances before putting the ball in the back. Of the I don't know. 